Hey guys, welcome back. El Flamingo here, your coach of the Cooperoo Crab Hammers. Uh, today's match is our week uh, two finals battle. Um, we're against Ben and House Luxray, who we played earlier on the season. He had the Groudon team, uh, but he's made some tra trades since then. And uh, he traded his Groudon for Rayquaza, and he traded his... Um, something else, and he's got Beware now. Um, so let's go through his team. He's got Rayquaza, Vileplume, Noivern, Klefki, Morpico, Minetric, Scolipede, Beware, Quillfish, and Mr. Mime Cantonian. Uh, last time I played him, I brought uh, a defensive Runarigus, I brought Fungus, I brought Barrascuta, I brought Lipard, I brought Eveltol and I bought um, Cradilly, but I'm bringing um, Escavalier this time instead of the Cradilly. So, um, I think he'll be bringing his Rayquaza for sure. Um, beyond that, I think at least one of the electric types, the Klefki or Mopiko, will be coming. Um, what is good against Ivelto from his team? Klefki will be coming uh, because, you know, Yveltal has um, Dark and uh, Flying Stab and Klefki resists both of those. Um, other than that, I'm not 100% sure what else he'll bring. Um, he might bring Quillfish because he knows I like Quillfish, so he wants to use that to destroy me. He could bring Mr. Mine to prevent Trick Rooms going up. Beware, I don't think he's going to put in a lot of work for him. Scolipede, I don't think he'll put in a lot of work for him. Uh, maybe Noivern to get up that Tailwind, but yeah, it's going to be a tough one to really pick what he's going to bring because he hasn't got a lot of threats against my team. Um, so with that, this is the team I have come up with. So let's start with uh, Rinarigas. So last time I bought a defensive set, this time I'm bringing the weakness policy set again. Um, so, max attacks, max HP, a little bit left over in Spideff. We have Protect, Earthquake, Shadow Claw, and Trick Room. I did have Rock Slide on there, but just found it wasn't really getting me much extra damage by having super effective uh, Rock Attack on there um, over, say, Shadow Claw. So, um, yeah, two attacks, Protect, and Trick Room there. Uh, with him, I have the Ibeltov. Um, Dark Pulse, Oblivion Wing, Snarl, and Protect, and he is rocking the Life Orb. I think I will switch the Snarl for Overheat, though, because I do have Snarl elsewhere on my team. So I'll probably do that before we go into a battle with Ben. Um, our next one is our Mungus. Again, with the Eviolite, max, close to max HP, close to max for death, a little bit in defense. Um, rocking the Eviolite, Rage Power, and Spore. Spore, which is um, pretty standard. Pollen Puff to give my team recovery. Giga Drain, uh, just to get some, activate the weakness policy on the Runarigus if they're out together. Um, next we have our uh, Escavalier. Not rocking the Assault Vest for once. Rocking the Ockerberry. Okay, that four, four times uh, weakness to fire. Is, uh, can be quite detrimental. So, again, just watching rocking max HP, max attack for Inspideth. Now, I'm not running uh, min speed on these guys. I am running um, enough speed, I think, to um, under speed um, Beware, which is his slowest Pokemon, I believe. Um, and then um, just in case I have it next to Ivaltol and I can get some airstreams up, having a Escavalier that isn't, you know, completely slow um, is a good idea. And same with the Runa Regis. Um, it isn't running absolute min speed. It has um, enough speed to under, under speed to beware. Um, in again, in case I get airstreams up next to the Ivaltol. Next we have the Lifehard. Max HP, max speed. I needed max speed because Manetric is 105 base speed and Lipard's base 106. Um, with that, I am rocking the eject button. Okay, trigger eject button, charm, and snarl. Um, and then 
Last but not least, we have the Barrascuta. So Protect, Drill Run, Ice Fang, Liquidation hits a lot of his team super effectively, except for, I think, Stolipede and Mr. Mime. Um, and I'm running the Propeller Tail in case he tries to do some sort of ally switch type stuff. Um, and then Focus Sash as, as the last item. Um, jolly Nature, yeah. So that's a, that's a team there. Um, we'll give him a red hot crack. His team is quite fast. Um, like I have a faster mon than all his, but um, he doesn't really have a trick room mode. So I am going to try the trick room mode first. If that doesn't work, I'm going to bring my fast mode in. Um, in saying if it doesn't work, if I lose to RNG, then I'll probably just bring the slow mode again. It's definitely a winnable game if it's an RNG based uh, loss. Um, but anyway, I'm going to get in contact with Ben, and we will, uh, I'll, meet, I'll see you in the battle. Alright, we're back. We are back and linked up with Benny. We're about to get stuck into it. Ooh! Am I going to go slow mode? Am I going to go fast mode? Let's find out. Okay. So, of course, he's brought the Requaser and the Neuburn to set up the, the Tailwind. The... Uh, Mr. Mime to prevent the trick room. <clears throat> he has Klefki, normally for screens, but maybe switcheroo as well. Um, he has Quillfish, because he knows I like Quillfish, and more Pico as his electric type. So I'm thinking, do I go fast or do I go slow? Um, hmm. Because I definitely underspeed him with my slow mons. But does he have a way to stop that? Uh, you know what? I think I might go Lipard, Alfred, Bane, Batman. Because I think his way to stop Trick Room. Yeah, yeah, we'll try that. We'll be uh, in prison with, um, what's his name? Uh, Mr. Mime. But let's have a look. Let's have a look, eh? So, I feel a taunt coming out. Oh, he knows I'm a eject button. What's he got in the back that can deal? Like, I just don't think he has anything that can deal with my... Oh, except for maybe more Pico. So let's go fake out here and shadow claw. Okay, so he's got Mr. Mine and Neuvern first. Game one. Max Mr. Mime is Pog. Going for air slash. Does he get the flinch? He does. Okay. So, I'm going to go snarl and I'm going to dine it and shadow claw. Because <laughs> I think he's still going to go for the imprison trick room. I assume it gets in prison. Let's have a look. Mr. Mime, does it get in prison? Oh, it doesn't. Damn it! <laughs> but it gets torn. 
Okay, so it's got Taunt. Wyvern's got Tailwind. And it's got... Um, Air Slash. Alright, so we're up. One. Nil. Um, Dragon. What's he gonna do? I feel like he's gonna protect and attack into. So I might swap there and Shadow Claw over here. So I feel like he's just gonna protect with his Rayquaza because he knows I've got a Jack button, and then um. Oh, I forgot to put Heatwave on Eveltal. That's all right. Why would you... You know I have a Jack button. We've got Ray Ray. Unless he's going to max guard, like... Bringing Joker now. And then Ray KO Rune. To me, who's that? Quillfish. Luckily, I don't have physical quillfish this time. A uh, physical. Um, um, Eveltol this time. So he only got two turns out of his trick room. If I can get these attacks off. Ooh, sucker punch would have been nice to work with that trick. But anyway. Battle of the Giants. Max Hailstorm. Shouldn't KO. Got to remember, Eveltol is a bulky boy. Do I not have Prankster? I think I forgot to put Crankster on my low card. Let me have a quick look. Forgot to put Crankster on my low card. <laughs> Um, 
How many turns of Tailwind are left? One. Okay. I think I will max guard and snarl. So what this will let me do is make sure I outspeed next turn. Um, and then I can get uh, my attacks off first. So let's go with that. I'll be able to... Yes. Cool. Use Acid Spray. Snow. It's quite a slow Quillfish. Do we know that um, Rayquaza is AB? We are going to go. Uh, we are going to go max airstream and charm. Oh, whoops! Snarl. Looks like we're going snarl. Citrus and liquidation. We've been at Tailwind and Air Slash. Quillfish does not get the kill. <laughs> So I'm going to Snarl and Iron Head into the Rayquaza. Iron Head and Snarl. I must be able to take off 49% from a Rayquaza. Whoa. What's he get? What's his increase? Accuracy. Huckleberry. He's got Flamethrower. Yes. Um, um, all right, we'll go snarl, we'll go iron head, we'll go snarl. Oh god, that was um, way less commanding than I was hoping for. So let's see, Mr. Mime had Taunt, Noivin had Tailwind, Air Slash, and Draco. Rayquaza had uh, Ice Move, Flamethrower. Um, Escav, KO, Ray. And Lipard, KO, Quill. And Eveltal, KO, Noiburn. Yes. Okay. Alright, so that was a bit of a scrappy battle. Okay, I think I'm just going to go for Trick Room now. I'm just going to go hard Trick Room. I'm going to uh, leave the light part at home. I'm going to go... I'm going to go the Fungus. I'm going to go Alfred. I'm going to go Batman. And I'm going to go... Oh, not you. Bang. 
All right, I think this is the, the team to go. Um, and it had acupressure. So AB Rayquaza, probably Focus Sash, Mr. Mime, Mental Herb Neuburn. My low part is useless since it um, uh, doesn't have Prankster. At least it's not going to get paralyzed, I guess. Rayquaza, Code Runerigus, and Rayquaza Hail. KO'd um, Ivelta. Okay, so game two. Game two. Um, we're running with the uh, fungus over the low part this time. Oh, I swear that Mr. Mime got in prison. Okay, well that makes life a bit easier. Let's see what he's going with now. Patch face and virus. Okay, I am just going to go uh, Rage Powder and Trick Room. He could be going double Trick Room. See what he does. So what did he leave at home then? He's got reflector. That's fine. Use taunt. That's also fine. So I'm going to go the Pollen Puff here first, and I'm just going to protect. Because I want to see if he's going to do some switcheroo bullshit. Yeah, knew it. Knew it. Cool. So we will pull and puff here and we will shadow claw here. Should have probably attacked the clef key there to try and um, activate the eject button. But, you know, shit happens. <laughs> Okay. Alright, looks like I'm maxing this turn. Oh, I don't get the KO. Has reflect and trick or we'll switch a room, whatever. 
All right. I'm going to start boosting um, my spadef and hit, and then I will start pollen puffing into my own Ritterigus. If Benny selects a move, we're at a bit of a stalemate here. Not a lot happening, but I think this will be the, the turning point this turn. There's a lot of damage. Back up to full health. Activate weakness policy. I'm at plus two. We know Rayquaza cannot max or cannot protect. So I think I'm just gonna start sleeping shit now. Okay, so rune. KO mime, and he goes for flamethrower. So it says to me he might not have a, a critical hit. <clears throat> I was like, damn, that does a lot. All right, so I'm going to put, <clears throat> unless he brings out a fake out mon, I'm going to put Rayquaza to sleep. So we'll spore into the Rayquaza. <clears throat> I think we still we still have one turn of Trick Room. <clears throat> and he's going Thoros. Okay, so he's probably going to go um, fake out into the um, Amoongus. There's not much I can do there. Do I let Amoongus go down? I think I do. We'll go for the Spore and we'll go for the uh, Max Quake right here. Right here, baby. Mm, so he's maxing. Big Ray Ray, Ray Ray, Ray Ray. So I've got plus, I'll have plus two in Spit F. Oh, what? Oh, this might have not been the best idea, unless he goes max guard. So max more Pico again. Whoever thought I'd be saying again, again. So now he'll have max darkness. I'm just going to rage powder and then max quake into the more pico. This should be an oko. Um, we'll see if he has safety goggles because he normally runs AV on his more pico, and we both and we all know that that's on the Rayquaza. <clears throat> Rage powder. Max darkness into yes. Woo! I think we got an Oko on more Pico. So we're back to neutral Spidef. Blizzard. We should go back up to Oh he's got Sugarberry. Nah, I still get the Oko. So Rune, KO, more Pico, and then um, more Pico, KO, Spoongus. What's he got? He's got Clef Key. Okay.
on plus one spadef. Do I go Dark Pulse to get max damage off onto it? Um, oh, that might be the go actually. So I might go Snarl and Protect. So if I go Snarl and Protect, I think that should be good. Snarl and Protect, yeah. So I'll drop this Spatak on things. Um, and then I may be able to survive a hit with, um, what's his name? Um, Rina Regis. Good. Good. Did you miss one? That'd be nice. No. Please don't crit. Cool. Alright, Snarl, and I'm going to bring in Bane. Do I though? No, and then I think I'll just... I think Shadow Claw might be a good idea. Yep. Yep. So I'm plus one, he's minus two. Fuck. He's using Blizzard, Alfred, avoid it. Sweet, okay. What's he gonna do, Dazzling Gleam, Flash Cannon? He's gonna Flash Cannon on. Awesome, awesome. Shadow Claw, dead. Yes. Okay. I'm just going to set up Trick Room and Dark, dark Pulse. Hopefully get a flinch. And Trick Room. Yes. Awesome. So Rune. KO. Um, what was it? Ray. Awesome. Awesome. Get Trick Room up. Okay, bring in Bane. Bane's got Drill Run. Okay, that was played, I feel, much better than the previous game. So let's go Drill Run and uh, Shadow Claw. There we go. I feel that was played much better than the first game. Especially since my part didn't have uh, Prankster. And then uh, Escav. KOs, um, Clef. All right, good game to my man, Benny. Um, <clears throat> that means we're through to week three of the finals. There's four weeks of finals, so we've got the two different conferences. So next week is the conference finals, um, and then the following week will be the big grand final. So next week I'll be either playing my man, Sam Wakeman, Wakeman VGC, or I will be playing um, Chris B. Um, he had the Galarian Moltres team. So that's my next week's opponent. Um, following on from that, um, this evening Australian time, I will be having my uh, second uh, RPDL match, and it'll be against um, Ed, who I played in the PBK. Um and his team, the Ninja Zards, I believe they're called. Um, and so he's got a pretty threatening Glastriere team. So that should be a, a good match there as well. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, share it with your mates. That would be fantastic. I shall see you all tonight.